Hi, everyone. Thanks so much for tuning in to this. Um, we're really excited to be doing a short series of interviews with current students at MBZ UAI to learn a little bit about their application experience as well as um, the student life experience and um, encourage you to apply to join the, gra join the graduate programs. Um, my name is Haley Pottle. I'm the manager for student recruitment with the Institute of International Education for the MBZ UAI graduate scholarship programs and I'm really excited to introduce our current student who's going to be answering a couple questions for us today. So I'll let him introduce himself with his name, where he's from, and what program he's in. Um, hello, uh, my, name is, my name is Abdurrahman Mohammed. Uh, I am from Egypt and I'm currently doing my master's in computer vision. Awesome, thank you. Um, so we'll, we'll just go ahead and get started on a couple of questions. So first, not a very surprising question. We would love to hear about how did you learn about MBZ UAI? Um, what made you first interested in applying? So like I was looking for a master's in AI because like AI was taking over the world and I wanted to be part of that. So I was Googling for a master's of, on efficient intelligence and almost all the masters I found were crazy expensive or they are not in the field that much. Until I stumbled upon the website of the university and I was astonished to find such a wonderful opportunity. <laughs> like teaching AI, a university that specialized in AI and it's a scholarship. It was just an like, amazing mix. <laughs> and remind us, are you in your first year of the graduate program or is this your second year at this point? What year are you in the program? Uh, for me, this is my second year now. Okay, amazing. So you'll be graduating this year um, from the program? By the end of the year, yeah. Great, that's fantastic. Um, so we would love to hear a little bit about what aspects of MBZ UAI have been the most impressive to you. So that could be the faculty or the location, the course offerings, um, what the scholarship entails. It can also be more than one thing. So just kind of share with us what's been the most impactful. So one of the most like impressive things that I didn't get to be around a lot is the amazing diversity in the university. Like there is like at least like, I don't know, 50 nationalities. Uh, it feels like we are doing a, a pseudo around the world uh, tour. Uh, that especially happened like we had an international day and we get to see all the sculptures. That was amazing. And also the courses that's offered by the university now, they are very good courses and they are very deep inside the field. So the, these two things are the most amazing things I've found so far. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you for sharing that. Um, and for your yeah, prospective students, there's a really cool um, video on the YouTube channel that highlights the International Day experience. And it's a really cool um, way to just really see the diversity of the community. So definitely encourage you guys to check that out. Um, sure. And then in terms of um, what have been some of your favorite experiences, it sounds like the International Day has definitely been a highlight. But if you can share a bit about maybe some experiences you've had in your courses or working with certain faculty members um, or just other experiences that have been um, some of your favorites so far. Um, for the courses, like it was always fun working on machine learning courses and trying to come up with a project uh, to share. Like for, for example, like my project in machine learning was doing image captioning is like you uh, give the, the computer an image and he tells you what's inside the image. So that was a very fun project to work on. And can you share um, a little bit about kind of what the student life experience has been um, like in terms of being able to, you know, make friends and community, being able to um, be able to network as well? So the student life experience is very amazing. Like, for example, like I don't think it took, took us less than an hour to become friends with everyone around us because we are very similar in our interests. And there is also, we have like a multi-use hall that we usually play like a weekly soccer game and, or a bing bong and volleyball, which is very healthy. And also we have like recently we're getting into PS5. So <laughs> it's a very fun like weekend you can have here with all people around you having the same interests as you. That's awesome, thank you. Um... So kind of looking at the application experience, there's I'm sure a lot of students who are really interested in this program and the amazing scholarship offerings, um, but um, you know, they're wanting to make sure that their you know, application is strong and wanting to make sure that they're doing everything they need to. Do you have any tips or suggestions for prospective students when they're submitting their applications or just any reflections from your experience when you were applying? Um. I think like while submitting the applications, you really should read, read a little bit about the field and 
and this will reflect in the essays we're gonna write. So understanding the field and their passion and write it on paper will make uh, it a very good uh, difference. And also like they shouldn't get really scared. Like if they are good on programming and have a good mathematical background and know a little bit about AI, this is all that matters, I think. So you don't, you shouldn't really worry about it. Just do your best. Love that, that's great. Um, so you kind of answered this question, but if you want to expand upon it a little bit, so if someone is feeling kind of unsure or intimidated, what are ways that you think would be good to, um, you know, for them to be able to position themselves um, when applying for MVC? Um, so in my opinion, I think like this is a very, very good opportunity that they shouldn't let it slip. Like, first of all, it's the first AI university in the world. Like, I don't think anything can be more cooler than that. And also like AI is gonna like be really controlling everything in the following few years. So it's better to be part of it than just watching from outside. And lastly, for people that are getting intimidated about the word AI, yeah, it sounds a little bit scary, but it's basically math plus programming. If you know math and programming, I don't think you will have any problem going through it. Awesome, thank you. Um, so this is a little bit off the cuff. I just wanna close this with one more question that just came to mind that would be interesting to hear your thoughts on. Um, would love to hear um, as we wrap up the interview for today, just kind of what skills or knowledge or kind of career development do you think that you've been able to gain so far with MBC program? And how do you think that's gonna carry you forward? Um, so basically when I came here, like I had no much, knowledge about research. I didn't know how to do research and I didn't read much research papers. So when I came here, like I found it way easier to read research papers and like, and understood how to conduct a research and also having a lot of people around you having the same interest and knowing and doing the same thing you do, uh, it really helps a lot on gathering info. And also the courses were really helpful at, on building my background more. So yeah, I mean, like overall, it was like a very good experience. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for taking the time to answer these questions about the application process, the student life experience, and really what you've been able to gain and really encouraging students to apply. So uh, again, for anyone who's a prospective student, um, definitely encourage you to start your application. You can do so at the MBZ UAI website, um, and you can indicate um, that you've learned about this experience through IIE event or um, we also encourage you to check out our ie.org slash MBCUAI website to learn about information sessions where you can gain more information. And the application deadline is April 30th. Um, so definitely encourage you to get started, initiate that application, and hopefully have an amazing experience later on at MBZ. Thank you so much. And we'll have a continued series. With us. Thank you. Thank you.